okay, so everything is done. to explain then uh, uh, say something about what was done and, and whatever way you feel appropriate for the outside people uh, no when we go outside i think you can summarize How long you have to keep generally? This one, just waiting for to cook a little. This is simply spinach. Simply spinach. This this dish is called simply spinach. Simply spinach. <laughs> <laughs> Baseless pizza, simply spinach and bottomless pizza. So this is the bottomless pizza. This is the bottomless pizza. This is simply spinach. As I said, the rice has been cooked. One part rice, one part water. There it is.
don't know how. Yes. Was it all right? Yeah. I'm sorry, I didn't explain. So, did I keep the time? 29 and a half minutes. <laughs> Any question? I wanted to show you another thing. Are you ready to? Okay, I'll just, anyway, let's go about these three things. Uh, can somebody feel some? I'm putting in some footage. Four five pieces. What's that? Offering in. Yeah. Any question? So do you want any explanation about the three dishes? Oh what I did. I'm sorry that I I should have actually I'm not you see I'm not used to giving this kind of class. I can do Bhagavatam class too. <laughs> Bhagavad Gita class. But chicken class is something very new to me. And anyway, and now I hope Krishna will like it. He's being offered. And uh, it didn't really, I'll tell you some mistakes that I made. You see, first thing is, I don't, I mean, I never really took for so long. And such a large quantity. But since I told you, I think people have diminished. So, and as a result of that, what happened is the stuff hasn't come out of the issue. Because uh, stuff, as I, as I said, should be crunched, it should be half cooked. But you know, probably that won't be right. And uh, the other thing is that the cheese for the tomato that I use in the bottom of this pizza, the cheese, I don't know whether it was the right kind of cheese. Because, uh, anyway, so that's the second thing. And the third is in spinach, I hope the quantity. Spinach and the proportion, spinach and some meat could have been all right. And what I should have done before, in a small quantity, to see what the ingredients are like. Okay, that's one thing. And a few things that you may take note, as I said, for rice, basmati rice, the way to cook it. One pot rice, you have to drain the water. And before, you'll see the rice today. Like before it dries out the com water completely, just switch off the fire, turn off the fire, and keep it covered. Water that is still there will be absorbed. So that is one thing. They were asking me about the salt proportion. The proportion of salt in big quantity of cooking is two, two uh, tablespoons for one gallon, uh, which comes to about roughly about one teaspoon for one kilo. Little more than one teaspoon. That that also depends. I love salt. Prabhupada used to like salt. <coughs> so that is the next thing. And so any question from anyone? You said 30 minutes, 30 people. So the timing is for shame. Like 10 minutes, 10 people? <laughs> <laughs> well, Actually, I thought that it would take me about 30 minutes to cook it. That's why I said 30 people. 30 minutes for 50 people. <laughs> because the thing is, you know, like, I'll tell you what, what is my thing. I like to, generally I like to cook myself. And Prabhupada said, 
that if you cook for yourself, you'll never become sick. That's one thing that, and also in the Vedic time, the Brahmanas used to always cook themselves. They would not, they would not even have the cooking. Uh, they wouldn't even take the cooking of other Brahmanas. And we have a uh, non-sticking frying pan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Okay, so this one maybe I anyway, this preparation is called roasting. R O S T I. It's a Swiss preparation. But the Swiss people make it too different in the sense they first oil. No, I need it later. Okay. You have a plug? So generally the, in Switzerland they very popular dish. I mean, no, no, flat. Flat? We have. So uh, they generally half boil the potato, then they grate. It's more tasty when you take, no, I mean, just raw potato and grate it and cook it. So that is one thing I'll try to show it to you. If we but that's not non sticking. It's not doesn't matter. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't I need some butter and some salt. It has So Can you plug in that one? So this one, you use the bigger one for creating. Don't press it too hard because the thinner it is, it's better. So this is on? Yes, my lad. It takes few minutes to hold. The electrical one, yeah. Same, same, the 
Did anyone, did any of you go to Switzerland? You did, you did. Where? We were in Lausanne. Lausanne. Lausanne or Lausanne? Lausanne. So there they don't take roasting. It's in the German part of Switzerland. Switzerland has got three major areas. Most prominent is the German part and then French part, then the Italian. There is three different Do it inside. I think that's really good. Yeah. They get salt and butter or something? Like inside. Go from here. Go from here.
just take the potatoes and let it cook one side. And you added salt to it? I added salt to it already. <laughs> Only salt? Yeah, just salt, nothing else. <laughs> I hope it got captured for people outside. Yeah, like a flip flop. We can explain how to do that for us. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the potato can be, that can be. So, 
Anyway, as they say, the taste of the pudding is in eating. Taste it now. Thank you. Any more questions? What kind of cheese? What kind of cheese? You see, here I use provolone. Provolone. It's Italian cheese. And it is like mozzarella, it melts well, but it, mozzarella doesn't have taste. There's provolone in that taste. So what I usually do, I use, you know, provolone uh, with sharp cheddar. But what happened is they have grated to prepare only the provolone. So, and when I started to cook linoleum, I realized that cheddar has an ingredient. And uh, so then I thought I'll just do it with the It was mozzarella, I think. Huh? Mozzarella. Was it? No. Yeah, mozzarella cheese. They put mozzarella? Yeah, mozzarella. <laughs> We didn't use mozzarella. Huh? We didn't use. Only one Only problem. Only problem. Only problem. How did you make it? Okay, it was the wrong. They showed the cover and the cover said like Glenn Sicker. Oh, they didn't use that. Oh, they didn't use that. Oh, anyway. So, <laughs> yeah. So anyone, any more questions? Thank you. <coughs> Question, no. All boys. I can also tell you, since we have some time, you see, I, was, I used to serve you. And those days, it was very difficult access to Shilpa, because Prabhupada had about 6,000 So you can well imagine how difficult it was. But then Prabhupada gave me the service to translate his books into the And that gave me the access to Shilpa. Like any time I could just go to Shilpa. Because I have the excuse that I have to show this <laughs> and, and then, uh, then Prabhupada one day called me and gave me a stack of big holy lenses. And he wanted me to front to reply. The way I used to do it, I used to read out to Shri Prabhupada the letter, and Prabhupada used to give me the points, what to reply, and then I used to write the letter, and then read them out to Shri Prabhupada, and Prabhupada would make some correction, and then finally I would make the final thing on Prabhupada's letter, write me, and then Prabhupada used to sign. So, Shri Prabhupada gave me the service as the Secretary for Indian Affairs. And so I was serving Shri Prabhupada. I was with him all the time. But I used to have a lot of time. And I used to wish that I could 